Do you know the story of Coco the Gorilla? She was known as the Talking Gorilla thanks to her extraordinary abilities, such as being able to communicate with over 1,000 signs, understanding many English words, and even painting. We share Coco's fascinating story in this Animal Wise video. Coco was a gorilla born on July 4, 1971 in San Francisco, California. At the time, the person who would become her best friend, Penny Patterson, was preparing her doctorate in psychology at Stanford University. Penny was interested in Coco as a subject to help her complete her studies, but she never imagined that she would spend the rest of her life with her. In order to teach Coco sign language and to communicate with her, Penny raised her like a child. Every day she taught her different signs that she also associated with their meaning. The first signs learned by Coco were gorilla, eat and drink. At the age of five, Coco already mastered 200 signs perfectly. Soon after, Coco's IQ was calculated, which turned out to be 85, just 15 points below the average in humans. Really impressive, don't you think? Over time, Penny realized that gorillas were already using a sign system to communicate with each other. Her work was to build on the foundations inherent in the species. Gorilla sign language is made up of a dozen signs, but Coco was able to learn more than a thousand words when she became an adult. As if it wasn't incredible enough, Coco understood English very well because every time Penny signed something, she also pronounced it in English. The only thing that prevented Coco from speaking our language were her vocal cords, unable to reproduce the phonemes that we humans use. After five years at the Gorilla Foundation, Penny announced to Coco that they would welcome a baby gorilla named Michael. At first, Coco rejected him as a jealous child might reject a new sibling. After countless fights, the caregivers found a way to make them hit it off. They locked them in a playroom together and they ended up playing. Coco was very connected to her emotions and never had problems expressing what she felt. Due to her great capacity for affection, Penny offered her a kitten which Coco called All Ball. It is believed she gave this name because the kitten had no tail. Unfortunately, one night a truck ran over All Ball and he died. Coco was heartbroken and was noted to have made sounds similar to human crying. Coco's fans mobilized in the wake of her sadness and sent photos of kittens to choose a new friend to adopt. Coco picked two new cats, naming them Lipstick and Smokey. Curiously, they were also both Mike's cats with no tails. The two gorillas loved to paint, Michael especially. They painted many works such as Love, Earthquake and Bird, demonstrating they were capable of representing symbolic emotions. Unfortunately, on June 19th, 2018, Coco died in her sleep at the Gorilla Foundation. The story of Coco and Michael has left a great legacy and we hope that more people will realize that animals also have conscience, feelings, and many of them, great intelligence. If you want to discover another story of an extraordinary animal, we share a video about Clever Hands, the smartest horse in the world. Tell us, what did you think of this story? Leave us your thoughts in the comments and we'll see you next time.